Right. So in this video, we'll see how to create configuration in Vector QNI or Canalizer. So to create this, uh, for, you have to go to uh, select file, go to file, then select a new. So from here, available templates, you can find many uh, templates. You can open Cartwax, Scan, Ethernet, Flexray, General. So uh, whatever template you want to add, so whatever configuration you want to uh, create for, let's say I am going, I want to create for Canoi. So you uh, Canoi and for channel two, uh, my hardware supports channel two, two channels, uh, two channels. And you if you and also some hardware supports single channel. So you can select this one with 500k for one channel. So I am going to select 100 uh, baud rate and with two channel. You can also uh, you can also select if you want to create can FT, uh, can open Ethernet, cut to So here we are not going to use. You can try this one and create configuration. See, so your uh, so see, so your configuration has created with two channels, can one, can two. So now uh, you have uh, you have created it. So that is easy. So uh, what is the uh, important thing after uh, after creating configuration is to, uh, to configure it. Okay, so how will you configure? Just go to hardware, then select which channel usage, and check here. Yeah, it is it is a two channel. Then select okay. No, there is there will be no change. Then channel mapping here also. Uh, you you will have to automatic remapping. Uh, like in uh, in my uh, previous uh, uh, videos, I have explained about uh, channel channel mapping. You can re refer that to videos. Uh, I will I will provide link of my uh, videos of channel mapping in in the descriptions. So here automatic thing you, you have to select and then select OK. So now select go to hardware and select network hardware. Here you have to check about it whether it is 500 or uh, something else. Uh, something else uh, of CAN1 and CAN2. After after checking this uh, you select use database settings. So once you connect your hardware it will be this option will be enabled. OK then select CAN1 and go to driver. And here you, will, you can see virtual canvas. Uh, my hardware is not connected that's why it is showing so if uh, let's say uh, i have canoe of 16901 okay so just expand it and assign canon and can2 so uh, if i refresh it so i have also added actually remove assignment I remove assignment so uh, just expand this and uh, select channel one and assign so here uh, we are using canoe so if you are using canonizer then you can select canon can2 Accordingly. So here I am uh, assigning channel 1 to CAN1 and channel 2 to CAN2. 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 So this setting uh, so this setting is that done. So if you want to remove this one, what you, you have to do, just right click on it and remove select remove assignment. Okay, then, so then close this window, then, uh, then select OK. And same same and same do for the CAN2. Then select OK. Now you have set uh, your channel is a channel mapping in network hardware and now what you will have to do you have to just go to simulation then sim select simulation set setup and select uh, right click on this and insert can interactive generator this ig block and uh, block select work so insert uh, ig block okay after enabling it just go to uh, diagnostic diagnostic iso tp and add your uh, cdd and pdx cdd pdx file here so uh, i'm not going to explain how to add this which i have already covered in my previous video i will provide that video in my uh, in this video descriptions you can refer that uh, description or else you can also refer that uh, uh, this video from uh, my playlist so uh, in that video i have explained in detail how to add what is cdd pdx files and how to add uh, cdd files in vector canonizer can so after so after adding uh, CD file, select OK. So this will be saved only when uh, when you have connected with your Canon vector, vector hardware to the computer. Otherwise, it will be not uh, not be able to save. Yes, I can show you. See, save option is disabled. So uh, it requires hardware to create con configuration. So when when you want to create any new configuration, just connect your vector Canon hardware, then uh, then create. Otherwise, your efforts uh, will be lost. So like this you can set your configuration. So thank you for watching.